Alright, so today I was playing Fallout 4, you know, as I have been the past few days, and, well, I guess I technically beat the game, but I beat the main quests, you know, where you have to side with someone, and then you do all this shit, and then you take down, you know, the big ones, you know, if you beat the game, you know what it means. But, um, yeah, so, I, I just put together some power armor and went out to the glowing sea and I found this relay tower so I go up to the terminal and I activate it because why not and it ends up um, actually you know, uh, putting out two different radio signals as you'll see in a second here also I haven't painted the power armor yet, so it looks like shit. But there, this stress signal found, which is the one that's important. So it basically tells you to like go somewhere south from the tower, uh, well, from the church chapel. But I went there anyway, and it turns out there's a bunch of feral ghouls inside. So I just threw a grenade, and then I see legendary enemy is mutated. So I'm like, oh shit, legendary, better go in there. And since it's a wizard, feral ghoul, you know, it's got to drop something nice. So I kill it, and the reason why I have 999 ammo is because I'm using the uh, Limitless Potential laser rifle, which is pretty good, but you know, you see here I get a plasma-infused automatic combat shotgun, which is, you know, it's fairly decent. But the first one I killed has a two-shot railway rifle. Now look at that. Why would you give this to me? That's just, it's just a recipe for disaster, but... Stats are 336 ballistic damage, 10 fire rate, 119 range, 52 accuracy, 14.4 weight, you know, that's good enough I guess. But, as, as I modded it, same damage, same fire rate, but 203 range, 89 accuracy, and 19.5 weight, and its value went up by like 100 caps and a bit more. So, I'm just going to show you a bit of it in action because it's a beast that one shots loads of things and rarely ever has to use a second bullet or spike I guess Now I do realize I could put in more clips, but that that's that just gives you a taste. I'm not gonna fight like a savage deathclaw. But if you enjoy videos like this, um, leave a like. And if I find another weapon that you know is great like this one, I'll make another video on it. So yeah, thanks for watching.